A few minutes later, she returned as I pulled the last drops of formula into my mouth. She picked me up and held me to her chest with my head over a cloth diaper she had draped over her shoulder. She patted my back and this time she was rewarded with a quiet little baby burp. Then she whisked me off to my new bedroom. I was appalled at the scene in front of me as we came into the nursery. Gino was tucked sweetly into a crib sleeping soundly with his thumb in his mouth. His illness must have affected his mind, he was regressing mentally into an infant. At least he looked the part, he looked so charmingly innocent, he could have posed as a model for an advertising campaign. Mama tucked me in at the opposite end of the crib and I fell asleep immediately after Mama finished tucking the blanket around me.